I think that as far as I'm concerned, I still feel the tension and, 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 and feel the focus of this is the game we want to win. I don't know that I shall be particularly satisfied if we don't win and know that we've got playoffs. Uh, we don't discuss that. So I can't imagine it's going to really affect the players' attitude because I know their attitude is going to be one of this is our game, this is our stadium, these are our fans. We are a good team. We are going to win. I'm, I'm pretty sure that's how they'll approach it. But maybe Stephen's got a, a view on that. Yeah, I don't, I don't. None of the players have mentioned the players playoff sort of thinking about that. You know, we want to seize this opportunity and you know do the job tomorrow. We want to win tomorrow. Well, I presume it will. I mean, I'm certain they'd rather play in front of 18,000 fans than hardly any fans at all, like like we've had to do sometimes away from home, and like perhaps Montenegro had to do in the game on Friday night. But, you know, we have a lot of Polish people living in this country and from what I understand, the FA were virtually forced into this decision to let the Polish FA have the tickets because otherwise there'd have been safety problems with infiltration of Polish fans amongst the English fans. And as far as I'm concerned, and I'm sure Stephen will back me up on this, our players are pretty used to playing in, a, in games where the opponents have their support as well. And I also think that uh, the 65 or 70,000 vis-a-vis 20 is a pretty good average, a pretty good uh, margin for us. And if our fans get behind us like they've done so far, then I don't fear that.